what is up you guys <laughs> this is probably gonna be like a crazy angle but that's okay look at my nails they are so well it's actually really bright hold on Let's see if we can turn that down see the vibes and all the lights anyways I'm trying to see what's the perfect lighting to start this in. This is my suitcase that I took to um, Disney. So we're gonna open the we're gonna open this today and see everything that came back from Disney. Everything in here is clean. Don't worry. Let me just open it. I'm just rambling. I hit the. This is the bottom. Obviously, because of the wheels. I hid the zippers under here. So, I don't know why, but I've taught myself that the handle is the bottom half. So, let me see if I'm right. Yes, I am. So yeah, I wanted to unpack with you guys, but I feel like my camera is so short too. I may have to prop it up on a chair. I have stacks of clothes behind me <laughs> that are that came from Disney, but I washed them and they're just here waiting for me to be putting them away. But these are clothes that I didn't get to wear. But I have to wash everything in here. So let me transfer you onto a stool. Hold on. I'm going to try not to cut anything out. <laughs> because um, I just, you know, don't want to hide anything from you guys. Here's my droid that I purchased. There's some candy. I gotta clean the room. You can't see me. That's weird. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, anyways. Have to, I wanted to clean the floor. It's not like shiny and stuff. So, um, I wanted to put the suitcase in here before I started sweeping. See, the droid is going to stay in here. I just, let's see, in the view. So let's see if we could do this. A lot of stuff in here. Here, I'll put you, I'll put it this way. Can we see anything? We really can't. Yeah. Okay, so this was my son's side and this was my side, but everything got mumbo jumbled around. So I'm gonna walk to the other side and grab some stuff. I wish I had some headphones so, or a mic that you could hear me. But I'm gonna talk loud, okay? So I'm kind of gonna explain everything, but not really. My mom makes these bags and I wanted the Grinch so bad. I also, she her first one that she ever made years ago, um, when she makes stuff 
for me personally she doesn't ever like really finish them so when she does actually finish them and gives them to me it's like the best thing in the world so this is the creepy one that I took out it pointed in the picture she had three of them I wanted a specific one and that one was going to a boutique that she is now selling these in <laughs> So the bag that I took was this and I told her to put like some something right here and she didn't so he just like kind of just hung out with me and my phone went in here so as soon as I wanted to like film something I knew that my phone was in here and yeah and my wallet fit in here too but yeah so he's gonna actually yeah I'm gonna keep him I love him <laughs> I was like I'm gonna give this back to my mom and see if she wants to take pictures with him, but that's okay. He's gonna stay. This might be a longer video <laughs> than I expected because there's like a lot of stuff in here. So this is what I bought in Disney Springs for my son. Oh, also there's some stuff in here, but I'm gonna probably take everything out because showing this stuff is like, cooler than everything that's in here so this is a polo shirt size large and I just didn't want it fitted on my son and then here is the black one that he was gonna wear on his birthday but it didn't have the red so I was like oh okay you know whatever we'll wear this to oh no it's dirty does it have a tag on it I took the tag off. What is my problem? Okay, well, this is gonna go to the rest of the stuff that I give away. Anyways, it's dirty. We didn't wear it. Um, what was I gonna say? This was gonna be our Hogwarts shirt, but it didn't work out. Luckily, I didn't take this one out the bag. I'm goofy. So I brought. I bought so many pants from Old Navy. I'm talking like 15 pairs of these pants. These are like my absolute favorite leggings. I don't know why. Like a lot of people love other leggings. For some reason, I just like fell in love with these. Um, let's see. Oh, I'm going to grab my undergarments out of here because that's just weird. So I'm just going to look for all my undergarments. And like I said, everything in here is clean, but they're, I mean, I'm not going to wash these because I got the tag on them, but definitely I'm going to wash my underwear because like it has the Amazon box and then my bag that I took. So stuff with the tags, um, I'm not going to wash. I don't even know where to put it in. I'll just put it in a box. Okay. So this we had, um, our days got so like mixed behind literally like mixed behind because um when we got there um we got there a little later than expected because we had to leave here four hours later than planned because there was like a big rainstorm and then there was like stuff going on in the states that we had to drive through so yeah we didn't go to medieval times we were gonna do sunday dinner at medieval times because it was the sunday night before my son's birthday and we love medieval times so much also we were gonna do tuesday when we went to disney springs i was gonna wear this we love rainforest cafe if, cafe and we always used to go there when he was little and so i was like oh my god that would have been so cool so this was the outfit like a tree <laughs> like that mom grandma tree or whatever the heck i thought i was like oh that's you know that'll match or whatever so that's that this I was going to wear to Epcot because I was going to be Belle Holiday. So she wears like this color. But my Nike shoes didn't show up. I had a call twice. And there's these Nike shoes that were on sale. Bef I think for like Black Friday. I got a lot of stuff for Black Friday before the holiday. Um, so yeah. These are like my favorite, favorite socks in the world. I like this. Victoria's Secret bra that I never wore. I'm gonna grab the stuff with the tags. These are my Ray Dunn uh, shorts from, I got from like Home Goods Marshalls. See, Ray Dunn. And I never wore the shirt. I ha still have a tag on the shirt. Just these shorts feel amazing. 
But I gotta put everything to the side to wash it. I'm gonna wash this. This is a bandeau that I was gonna wear under this because it's a little see-through. Here is another skirt that I have that I was gonna wear in case like I overpacked because, and I packed last minute before I left. This goes, I did wear this because I have like no other sweater. See, here's the, this thing. Um, what is in here? Oh, I think I have like a lot of my panties in here. I don't know. Like last minute, we had to like exchange rooms from the hotel we were in like quite a few times. So everything was just like really hectic for our vacation. And so like I said, a lot of the days got switched out. This was supposed to be a shirt that went under there. I'm gonna take a minute. These are my absolute favorite shorts. They're from Amazon. They came in a pack of five. More old navy leggings because I cannot get enough. And then I had all my clothes. This is how everything was like organized and fit. Like it was so beautiful. Like it's like there it was just magnificent. These don't have tags. I'm not gonna wash. I'm just gonna wash that all my other stuff. Here is just like white tanks that I'd wrap my hair in, my wet hair to dry. Here's how stuff is rolled again. Oh my gosh, it's thunderstorming. I don't know how these got like this, but maybe I tried them on or something, but I didn't wear them. They look like it's like deodorant or baby powder or something. They're Juicy Couture leggings that I got on sale on Amazon. That's what I said. I was going to wear these on Planet Batu, but I wore my green ones instead. There's some undergarments. More undergarments. Oh, I did wear these pantyhose that I got from Shein to... Um, Universal. What is this? More. Oh, these are really soft. These are like cotton leggings. I was gonna wear this shirt with this skirt to medieval times, I think. And if it wasn't gonna be this. It was going to be um, another tank that I wore. I had like two of them. These I got at Old Navy for like $5 and I never got to wear them. You, we could not wear shorts there. It was way too freezing. Here is the skirt that I wore for Hogwarts. This was a dress, the Minnie Mouse dress that I wanted to wear when I did my unboxing. And then I had like a black long sleeve situation happening. <laughs> oh, here is my favorite, I don't know, Oversized long sleeve. I actually have one on right now. Look, at it. it's ripped. What should I change? It's clean. I'm gonna change into this right now. Ah, I still got like another side. It is pouring. You hear that? It is coming down. Just as long as it's not in the negatives, that's okay. Like, I do not like negative five degree weather. 
And once it hits the negatives, I swear it all feels so cold and all the same compared to negative five degrees, negative 15 degrees. It literally is completely frozen. Oh, that's better. It's like so much more bigger and like comfy. And uh, I'm still <laughs> probably <laughs> with my thumbs. <laughs> same space, whatever. Let's get finish with this. All right, once I got to like Universal, I um put on my Camp Crystal Lake Counselor hoodie. I know it's for like an HHN thing, but oh my gosh, I freaking love Universal and their little Horror Night Spectacular. Um, here's some tags from, I don't know, I guess my bag and a pair of pants that I wore. Oh, my green ones. This I was going to put in my, um, my space buns that I had, especially when I was going to wear this. But now you've seen my blow up tank thing for my party balloons, decoration stuff. I love to decorate. Here is that compression tank that I wore and some Halls wrapper. Let's see, I put this in here because I don't know, this is just like weird to me. So it's like a Baymax um, sheet. Here are the shorts that go with that. Um, see, the tags are still on these. Um, here's just, I like to like sleep in these. This is from Victoria's Secret. Definitely I slept in this one, probably with my hoodie. I think I want to wash my hoodie. I washed it before I left, but there was like nights where that heater was on and I like didn't know how to program in it, program it. And then I also had like the steam, like really hot steam shower for everybody. So we could like, you know, clear whatever toxins that were happening. And to be honest, we only got sick for like a day and a half. We didn't even sound crazy. Oh, if that shirt wasn't going to work, I also have that one. Um, let's see, I have some pair of socks. I do not like these socks. I hate how they feel socks. Like, this is horrible. They shouldn't make socks like these polyester things. But this was when we went to that CVS slash Walgreens in Orlando. I just wanted some socks before we went to the Nike outlet. Like we did end up going to, there's like a lot of things that I didn't film because it's like, I was driving and a lot of was like, go, 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 go. And I was just like on mom, like not even vacation, but like mom celebration mode. Okay. So these, I did wash them. Uh, but, so these are Monday night when we went to Universal. We went to go see a Fantasmic show. And tell me why. Okay, so like my son and his dad like both have foot injuries. So my toe hat, my toe, <laughs> my son's toe is, um, he's still dealing with that. So I didn't want him to walk. I wanted to like literally nurture my son for his birthday. And so we put him in a wheelchair because my son's dad was just going to end up needing the wheelchair at any point as well, because he is not supposed to walk for long periods of time. So it was just like a convenience for me where we got to see things you know, needing that wheelchair. So back to the story. So at the end of the night, we went to go see Phantasmic show and they don't tell you where to like park your wheelchairs. They don't even tell you that you could bring in your wheelchair. I have no idea, but we had a uh, Diet Coke, another Coke and a Sprite and they were filled and they took our wheelchair <laughs> and we were like low key sad. Oh my gosh. I feel like there's like some, there's like always some stuff like like little orbs or some weird like dusties flying around all the time in my freaking videos i'm like what the heck so 
So yeah, anyways, um, yeah, they put them back. So then anyways, um, we went to guest services and um, so we just told them, we explained to them what had happened and they couldn't really like refund us. And then I was like really sad. And then I seen the main, main guest services, like complete main, main person. And then my son told him that he didn't, he just wanted these, like he was trying to collect them. Like again, we had, you know, a collection of five. Um, and so, yeah, um, so we got more of these. <laughs> because he gave us a park hopper thing and also he gave us like a little redemption certificate for $16 to get uh, our coke and sprite and diet coke little bombs back like I love Disney World so much like even though like if they ever made like a mistake like taking a wheelchair like okay yeah whatever but like they told us oh we can't go back here because it's closed because of show and i was like oh okay we had a wheelchair okay well you gotta go back that way down to where phantasmic exits because all of half well wherever you would go enter for um the hollywood tower of terror that was closed and that's where we left our wheelchair so then she directed me back to like the exit a phantasmic and there was like no wheelchairs around and then yeah we were just like so bummed so sad because we had like plans for these as like artists and so yeah anyways that's the story of that <laughs> uh, i feel like there's like stuff in here anyways um here's some more pj shorts Let's see what is in here. There's nothing in here besides a Halls wrapper. And then let's see what's in here. Oh, we went to Wonderworks. And then if you fill this thing out, you get a little gift so we got a slug i don't even know where he went a little slug oh we got a darth vader stormtrooper sticker we got coupons for whatever was in wonderworks here is my duty and bird for my wallet um Oh, I got a Wonderworks pen. And that's it. So, let's see what's in here. I'm going to find what's in here. And so, the 50th celebration is over. And so now, with these nails, I'm literally selling, celebrating the 100th Walt Disney that was created in 1923 so um somewhere along the line in october it is uh, so i'm gonna start with this because we went here first in the morning and then we went to disney springs at night so this is i forgot what it was called basin and it's a soap house in um the grand floridian I don't know what this is. It's just like a little car. Maybe so your soaps can like, you know? I don't know. Here's a receipt. Um, both soaps were $7.19. So my total came out to $15.31 for these two holiday soaps. And so I got this one. And and literally, it looks, it's like a bath. You see, it's like a bath <laughs> or a sink. It, they both smell so good. It just says Mickey. It doesn't like say what the scent is. Anyways, yummy. And then when we went to Disney Springs, we went to, oh, this is also from, uh, Grand Floridian at breakfast. And here's some receipts. I don't know where's this receipt from. Anyway. Uh, this is for my gummies and my 50th bag 
and my pen and my total was 21.28 and so this is what I got oh here's a slug from um, Wonderworks here are the green gummies these are super super good they also had um, blue ones blue sour ones but, oh my gosh, the white belly of these frogs and the way that it smells. They're yummy. Oh. And here is the pen. I love it so much. It writes so good. The pen was twelve ninety nine. I love it. I wanted to get more snacks Ooh. <laughs> because I got these before we went to the movies, but also when we went back to Hollywood Studios the next day. Um. I seen these in this the store next to Star Wars tours. Like it's in the back. If you're a Star Wars fan, but you don't like like you don't want to go on the Star Wars tours at Hollywood Studios, go to like the exit. There's like a hidden shop and there's like stuff for kids to do. So that's where like sometimes you would see I would see the, these small kids with like these plastic lightsabers and they build them themselves. You could build your own lightsaber if you have like a five-year-old kid and I'm sure they're like so much more cheaper. But yeah, that's like a hidden thing to do for kids is go to the gift shop at um, Star Wars Tours in Hollywood Studio. There's like a lot of things like I was like, oh, okay, but also like, it was like a lot of like go, 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 go fast pace. But also I had very much so, so like fun. Like I was in awe of the land. So again, I didn't buy too much because I didn't also want to carry a lot because we drove and that freaking small car. Like I was like, oh, this is small, but it was comfy. I don't know. Here is a receipt for Droid Depot for Droid Depot um we got the custom backpack so our both of our droids were 119.99 each and then we got the custom backpack which was 59.99 and then we got the chip which was 14.99 so the two droids with one backpack and one chip totaled out to 335.43 and that was the droid that you've seen back there. And then here I'll put everything this side. Because I still got stuff right here. I'm going to show you my son's droid. Also, I didn't even do close-ups of my makeup, which I see in here. This is my son's droid that he built. And this is his remote. lightsaber receipt went to because sometimes the prices change and at one point when I kept um because I have been basically kind of doing this stuff like uh planning everything since July because I just <laughs> I noticed my son was turning 11 and he was born in 2011 and I was like, whoa, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. I really want to, I know my son like loves Star Wars, but hold on. Let me give it an excuse because he's into Harry Potter and I'm into Harry Potter, but not like huge, but I thought it would be like 
cool, you know, to go for my son's 11th birthday. And that's when Harry realizes that he is a wizard at the age of 11. And I just think that is so cool that my son turned 11 years old and was born in 2011. Like, I think that is just, like, so cool. And also, I went when I was, I think I was, like, 10 years old or something. I don't know how old I was. But it was in 1997. And they were having their, the kind of, like, the middle of their 25th anniversary. So, I went to Walt Disney World. I went to all four parks um oof uh yeah in 1997 and then in 19 oof no sorry in 2017 uh we took my son when he was five this is not my wand so <laughs> i just kind of want to show you the one that he chose it was professor dumbledore Depends. professor dumbledore so yeah, this is the one that he chose. They said that this is like one of their best wands because it's like actually made of metal, you know? It's like their only one that's made of metal. And the other ones are just like painted. But I was watching someone after like, I think I was like, already home and i'm just like miss like i just love disney watching these disney videos like so much you have no idea um so yeah i just noticed that you can i don't know if it's in disneyland only but you can get it engraved i would have got his name engraved i have no idea so that was the one that i should have showed you <laughs> that day I think you have to also pay for the bag, which is probably also a dollar. I don't know. I don't know seats not in here. So this is some of the stuff that... Um, oh, here's one of the... Oh, I didn't finish it, so that's probably why I didn't show you. Um, yeah, I didn't do close-ups of these. So let me take all my stuff out. I got this from the Disney store. Uh, I don't know if I've ever talked about it. I probably talked about it. I don't know if I've ever shown it. But this is um, a towel. You can basically at Disney, the Disney shop app, you can custom your purchases and put your kid's name or your name on them. I don't, it's not very expensive at all to do, especially if they have like a sale on something and go ahead put your kid's name on it like that is so cool you see like what the heck some of these shirts i don't know these are clean though this hat's clean but i wash it these are my son's shorts a single clean sock another clean sock this white sock <laughs> I was just like throwing stuff last minute too. Like, oh, what if he needs these socks? I didn't even know if they freaking matched. They didn't. Actually, it's crazy. I just wash everything. I'm <laughs> going crazy. This is a lot of stuff. In here, here's this wax wonderworks house. So you got a receipt in here for who? Squidward plushie was 22 and his total was 23.43. I don't know if people want to know that. And most of the time I don't even put, um, I just love that this says Universal Studios. So I think I want to save it. <laughs> it literally is from Universal Studios. I think that's so cute. I got this. I'm like, Aiden just played at me. He didn't want to because 
he didn't want to touch a lot of stuff like he didn't want to go on like 3d rides and he didn't want to like touch that thing he's like it smells like metal i'm like just please i want her and so that's why i wanted him to get to play again or play another game because it would have been like an easy win for him i would have just let him win but he let me win and i think she's so cute i'm just like so happy that they're not completely getting rid of universal monsters So here are, this is the Sprite, it's like brand new. This, I just can't get enough of Disney Coke. I think it is so freaking good. Their Coca-Cola there is like magical. I don't know what it is, but it was delicious, especially their Fountain Coke. I had no idea that was there. So had new shirts, polo shirts, shorts. I don't know what this is. What is this? Oh, this is. Oh, this is more. <laughs> These are new shirts. These are his dad's. Here is from my um cold calf brew and here is the blue milk so you can see the sizes i'm so mad they threw away the other blue cup i would have made a mickey mouse i was like you guys this is recyclable i can't speak and i don't know why <laughs> i'm gonna have a hard time when i have my invisalign you guys okay um just more shirts what shirt is this? I'm saving this bag. Yeah, I guess so. Another black shirt. And our butter beer mug. Of these Next. all right so that was everything in our messy suitcase as you can see right here is our lightsaber <laughs> okay I gotta clean everything up and I'll see you in the next one bye